I saw a tweet. I want to shout out this tweet from at Jared Dicker. What is the last name? Um, Great name. <laughs> he tweets about media and media companies and stuff like that <laughs> pretty regularly. Um, so his tweets are usually pretty interesting. But he was talking about the subscription media business. You know how a lot of companies and even individuals are turning to subscription for recurring revenue? Yeah. Well, he is talking about AOL. And AOL is such a distant company in our minds, right? One of the early internet companies, but they still have one to two million Americans who are still paying for their services. What? what services? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I mean, they did like dial up and God knows what else. And <laughs> the, this guy's talking about how the power of subscriptions is that you can have people subscribe at a low annual rate and then you just kind of hope they forget to cancel it. <laughs> Dude. Yo. You know what I mean? Like that is most likely the case with AOL is that there's a bunch of Americans who it's such a low fee that they probably just might have forgotten about it or they're not really in tune with checking their statements, whatever it is. And they're still Yo. paying for freaking AOL dial up. And AOL's reportedly making um, around $250 million a year. Yeah. Just in in revenue, and who's who's still using AOL, bro? bro Literally, imagine almost having nobody. <clears throat> having that kind of cash to where you just you don't look at your bank statements at all. You don't ever look at your account <laughs> balance. You just go on with your daily life. Somebody took out fifteen dollars this month, and you know I don't really care because I have all this money. That I don't really Yo, care about. I Damn. freaked out because SSFCU took my little power checking fee, and I said, "What's this twenty bucks right here?" <laughs> Right, what the, the hell is this? And that's <laughs> that's the unfortunate reality is that it's probably older folks who right are not as right. in tune with their banking app and they don't even remember what the hell they're paying for, and they're kind of being taken advantage of, you know? Yeah. Well, now there's there's yeah. services now I've I've seen ads for them all the time that will like go through and see like it'll go through your yeah. I, I don't know how safe these are but they'll go through your email and your record and whatever to see where all your and you'll be like oh look you're spending you know four hundred and ninety dollars a year on these subscriptions you're like wait what in the hell is all yeah. these little subscriptions that you've been paying for six years little WordPress sites and hosts and I don't know stuff like that Something they just, you just never forgot used. you subscribe to you know I've done that I had like a website for like some music company I was gonna start like six years ago and I was like I just got charged one hundred twenty dollars for it I'm freaking the domain go or daddy something. or whatever and i was like what in the world is this dude like, but it goes to show the power of subscriptions is that yeah well, people I, might forget start a subscription I, I think that's why people started doing i mean not why but i think a good tactic is with gift cards because you buy 20 dollars on a gift card right and then you spend 1950 well, then what are you going to do with that 50 cents you're going to hold that card in your wallet like no like most people just kind of put it to the side Eventually, they forget about it. I don't really want to call to find out I have 50 cents on this card. So then they just throw it out. Or even like I've done a couple of times where you just buy the card, you know, you intend to give it as a gift and then you accidentally just throw it out. And now there's 30 bucks right there. Yeah. But then those 50 cents that everybody's throwing out, I mean, that adds up every single year, every single card that you're getting. And, you know, these people are just getting free money. Like, that's crazy to me. That's why Dude. I always buy stuff for more than a gift card is. So I use it all up as a discount on what I really want. There we go. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So like if I got $20 to Orange Leaf, I get $22 worth of stuff. Two out of Imagine pocket. Big ass cup of Froyo because yeah, you like, want <laughs> No, I get like three cups of just Sour Patch Kids. It's just like free candy. <laughs> <laughs> just put it in a bag and take it home. It's <laughs> just like, hey, I brought my own bag. Is that all right? Dude, Let's put even, it on the put on the scale. Even this show, we used to use Anchor, right? Remember that those days? Yeah. Somebody's still paying us five bucks a month on there. Probably a family member or something. Bro, but, it's probably a great. It's probably a grandparent. Or someone we should let them know. Like, <laughs> I I kind of doubt that they know that. <laughs> like <laughs> that's crazy. I doubt they still find us worth paying the but five dollars. It's around. a it's a good example though. Yeah. Shit, we need to put some more shoot. subscriptions out here. That's crazy. Honestly. I yeah, like honestly, once a, a, about once a month I go to Anchor just to retrieve my five bucks. And get out of this. <laughs> we need that five dollars. <laughs> oh, um, we. If you're Yo, listening, well, we're still making use of it. So yeah, shout out to you. Yeah, out to you. <laughs> yeah we gotta we gotta start a subscription then. One hundred percent. I mean, yeah, we we still have one. Go to the link in the description. <laughs> you want to support? Sign up, sign up for our email list. That does kind of get me sometimes. 
It's on AOL. <laughs> We're one of the paid subscribers here. Go to AOL.com slash Tillcast. <laughs> the dial-up tone just kicks in. Oh, yeah, that'd be nice. I like that. Yeah, I missed that sound. On.